More often than not, your customers don't know what problems they want solving until it becomes an issue. And because of that, you need to be able to change in this complex environment. Hi, I'm Jack, Director of Everyday Agile, and this is my case for agility in business. People's wants and needs are constantly changing. Therefore, your organization needs to be ready to adapt. Now, there are two main ways to deal with this. Option number one, we gather lots of requirements up front and assume what people want solving and deliver them the whole lot at the end. Option two, we can start with one problem and solve others as we go. I like to think of it like this. The traditional way is like firing a cannon. We ready the cannon, we aim and we fire, not really knowing what problems that cannonball is going to encounter along the way. We just hope it's going to hit the target and be a success. The other way to look at it, i.e. the agile way, is to think of a modern day missile. Once it's been fired out of its silo, we can change its course whilst it's in flight. And if we really made a mistake, we can abort it without causing too much damage. By harnessing this approach, we now know we can change direction if needed, just like the problems the customer wants solving. And if all else fails, we can abandon a project or product without causing too much harm. To put this into perspective, pick up your smartphone and look at how many updates it currently needs. Each one of these updates is trying to solve a problem a customer has whilst maintaining functionality. That is the beauty of an agile environment. Here at Everyday Agile, we love helping our clients build that sort of environment while supporting the creation of products customers love, whether it be training, consultancy, or implementation. We're not offering death by PowerPoint. We're not going to get involved in client politics. If we don't know the answer, we won't guess. Think of Everyday Agile as your compass to point you in the right direction. If you feel like we'd be able to support you, then reach out in all the usual places.